I know it's, it's a cold morning, right? But how many of you are joyful to be in the Lord's presence? Amen. There's no other place uh, which is more thriving. There's no other place there. There's more joy than in the presence of the Lord. Amen. Right. So before we just, uh, before the team just gets ready, can you just go around, just meet a few people, give them a smile. I know you'll be doing that after church, but you can even do that now. Sorry about that. Ephesians chapter 3 verse 20 says, Now to him who is able to do exceedingly, abundantly, more than we can ask or imagine. Right? Uh, and here as we come into his presence, right, expect things, expect God to come and touch our lives. You know, it's not about the songs, but it's about his presence doing something in our lives. Amen. Shall we just lift up our hands and say, God, we just thank you. Lord, we thank you for your Holy Spirit. We thank you, Lord, that your word says that where there's two or three gathered in your name, you are present, O oh God. Lord, we thank you that over the past 11 months, Lord, your faithfulness was upon us, God. Lord, the very fact that we are standing here alive, it's because of your presence, God. And we thank you. We thank you, Holy Spirit. To you, our hearts are open, O oh God. Our lives are open, O oh God. Nothing is hidden from your frame. We just worship you. Come on, just raise up a voice to him. Just thank him in your own ways. Over the past 11 months, Oh, just his faithfulness upon our lives. Just his love, his care, his protection, his providence. Just think about the things that God has done for you personally in your lives, in your family. And just say, God, we're just so thankful. are open to you our hearts are open God come and have your way come and have your way come and do exceedingly Lord 
exceedingly and abundantly more than we can ask or imagine, Lord. Yeah, come and do, come and do what you do, Lord. What you do best, oh God. Come and have your way. We are here, we are here for you, Jesus. Oh. We are here. Yes, we are here for you. Come on, just tell them that, God, we are here for you. We are here to seek your face. We are here, God, to see your face, to hear your voice. Won't you come and have your place? Come and be enthroned, Lord. Oh, 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 Jesus, to you our hearts are open, nothing here is hidden, you are our one desire. fire fall down to you our hearts to you our hearts are open nothing here is hidden you are our one desire you alone are holy only you are worthy God let your fire fall down sing that again to you to you our hearts are open to you alone oh god and you you are our heart's desire you alone are holy only you are worthy god let your fire fall down Your breath come from heaven, fill our hearts with your life. We are here for you, only you, Jesus. We are here for you. Oh, let's just sing that again. Let our praise be your welcome, God. Let our praise be your welcome. Let our song. Cause we are here for you Only you God We are here for you To come Lord Let your breath Come from heaven Fill our hearts With your life We are here for you We are here for you. 
lift up our hands as we sing this and say God we welcome you we welcome your power we welcome your presence almighty God of love we welcome you with praise we welcome you with our praise almighty God of love be welcomed in this place let every heart adore let every soul away, Almighty God of love, be welcomed in this place. Yes, God, we just welcome your presence. Lord, we just thank you for your goodness upon our lives. We thank you for your goodness upon our lives, oh God. And we sing of your goodness. We sing that you are good, Lord. No matter what situation we're going through, Lord, you are good because that's what your word says, Lord. Your word says, God, that you are good. Thank you, Jesus. Okay. Church, I'm going to need your help now. Right. How many of you can just shout out a scream and say, God, you are good. You are good. Oh, I could hear nobody. Come on. God is good. And all the time. Oh, yeah. 
Amen. God is good. And all the time. Okay, really loud. Come on. I, I, so many people here. I'm not able to hear you guys. Come on. God is good. And all the time. Okay, we're going to sing of His goodness now. Okay, can you sing after me? Oh, come on. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, okay. One more time, come on. Oh, 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 one, two, one, two, three, four. Well, you are worthy of our prayer. 
nobody else deserves your, our praise, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your love, oh God. Thank you, God.
No shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming after me. Yes, you won't go. No wall you won't kick down, lie you won't tear down, coming after me. No shadow you won't light up, no mountain you won't climb up, coming after me. No wall you won't kick down, lie you won't tear down, coming after me. Come on, church, lift it up. No shadow you won't light up, mountain you won't climb up, coming after me. Yes, you are gone. No wall you won't. in the valley, God. Oh, just to get to us. No shadow you won't light up. No mountain you won't climb up coming after me. No wall you won't kick down. Lie you won't tear down coming after me. Yes, God, your love just comes after us, oh God. We thank you, Lord. And I will love you, Lord, my sheep. And I will love you, Lord, my rock. Forever, all my days, I will love you, God. I will love you. I God, I look 
to you I won't be over Give me vision To see things like you do God, I look to you You're where my help comes from Give me wisdom You know just what to do Yes, you know what to do And we look to you We look to your ways Your work and your power, God God, I look to you I want me all well Give me vision To see things like you do God, I look to you you're where my help comes from Give me wisdom You know just what to do And I will love you, Lord, my strength I will love you, Lord, my shield I will love you, Lord, my rock
song to him who sits on heaven's mercy
Lord Jesus, we just give you all the glory. The kingdom is yours. The honor is yours. And all of the worship is yours, Jesus. We worship you. And we honor you in this place. Bible tells us that all things were made by Him. And without Him, there is nothing that exists. And He is the head of the church, which is His body. The Bible tells us that the Father desires that in all things, Jesus is preeminent. That in all things, Jesus Christ is number one, preeminent. So we just look to him this morning and say, Jesus, you are preeminent in my life. You are number one in my life. In all things, in all our singing, our worship, our music, our preaching, our teaching, everything. In everything. Jesus Christ must be preeminent. He must be number one. He must be the focus. He must be the reason of everything. Jesus, we honor you, Lord. We worship you. We acknowledge your preeminence. You being the number one. You being the only one. Sovereign God. Be exalted in this place this morning. Request us to please be seated. Just continue in worship as we prepare our hearts to partake of the Lord's table together. The Lord Jesus instituted this for us. Before he was crucified on the cross, he sat at the table with his disciples and he set this in place. The Apostle Paul teaching us to do this until Christ returns. And this morning, if you are a believer, you love the Lord Jesus Christ, you're born again, you're welcome to partake of the Lord's table with us. We request you to please hold on to the elements so that every till everyone is served and then we will pray and partake together. I just request you to take this few moments to pray. Turn your attention to the Lord and what He has done for you personally on the cross. Take some time to thank Him for it. There's a need in your life. Extend your faith and say, Lord, I know you died to provide for me, for my needs. Whether it's healing in your body, overcoming sin, seeing the release of God's blessing over your life. Receiving God's shalom, well-being, total well-being. We just pray. Extend your faith and say, Lord, you did this for me on the cross. And this morning, God, as I eat this bread and drink this cup, I want to receive that blessing that you provided for. Father, in the name of Jesus, we sanctify these earthly elements, Lord. It reminds us of our covenant with you and who you are to us and what Christ finished for us on the cross.
Lord, as your word tells, teaches us, the power of sin has been broken. Satan's hold over our life has been broken. That the curse has been removed so that the blessing may be released on up, upon us. I pray, Father, in this place that the power of the cross be released in each of our lives. That we do not do this just as another ritual. But we do this in order to receive the cup of blessing. To receive the blessing of the cross. The power of the blood. The power of the finished work of the, of the cross our lives. Just want you to go ahead and open the container. Lord Jesus said, take, eat. This is my body, which is broken for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Let's partake of the bread together, knowing what Jesus has done for us on the cross. Let's partake together. The Lord Jesus said, this is my blood of the new covenant. It is poured out for many for the forgiveness of sins. Let's partake of the cup together, knowing what Jesus has done for us through his blood. Right now, in Jesus' name, I declare the breaking of every bondage to sin every oppression on the mind every sickness, disease infirmity, I command those chains on our bodies to be broken and release the blessing of the cross upon our lives in Jesus name Amen. Amen.